out for a ride today on Bandit, my Kimco Super 8 150, and today we're visiting Miller Park. Uh, Miller Park is probably about, uh, I'm guessing, 16 to 20 square blocks of uh, park that's uh, a really old park. I don't know when it was uh, formed, but it was formed a long time ago. So we're going to take you for a loop around the park and just kind of show you what they got here. Off to the right, somebody's having a reunion there. They got a big banner up. Um, also to the right back there is uh, a Vietnam Veterans Memorial. Uh, coming up here we have the Miller Park Zoo. Uh, it's a very nice zoo. They've done a lot to it over the last 15 to 20 years to uh, really jazz it up. Off to the left there is a uh, water park for free water park for kids to play in and uh, splash around. Uh, the zoo is all on the right here. They've got it all, these big greenery uh, bushes or trees there so you can't really see in, but uh, got a stop sign here, double check for traffic. The cat houses are on the right there. They, uh, along with the red roof is where they hold uh, the lynx, the uh, snow leopard and lion, and I think there's a panda in there and some other things. So it's a pretty nice zoo. Uh, in front of us here, we got Miller Park Lake. They've got uh, paddle boats that you can rent and uh, paddle around the lake, which I've done and is uh, fun. It's a nice uh, way to get out on uh, a lake and not have to have a boat. Lots of times you'll uh, come out by the lake and see people fishing. A lot of people fish this lake. It's free to fish in as long as you have a fishing license. So uh, you can see that. Uh, also, uh, probably every weekend there's uh, families and stuff out here picnicking and uh, just enjoying the outdoors. And they've done a lot of work, especially to the shoreline here on the right, uh, to really uh, improve it and putting sidewalk in and some nice retaining walls. Uh, there's a fountain up there that you can see. It's uh, a really nice place to uh, come and visit and relax for the day. Coming up here is a uh, memorial for, I believe, World War I veterans. Uh, it's a pretty neat little monument. They don't build monuments like that uh, in local parks anymore. At least I haven't seen any, like, uh, for any of the current wars that we've been in. Uh, there's also some uh, old vintage war uh, tank and uh, artillery gun there that you can see. Next is Engine 639 and its caboose. Uh, it was placed here by the local train club and three or four times a year they give tours of it and let you know uh, how steam engines worked in the day and all that. Uh, a neat thing that we uh, talk about, I used to be in the club and that was when they moved the uh, train down the street to set it in position here on its tracks in the park. It was so heavy that it cracked the concrete street and uh, up until just a few years ago you would drive down the street to get to the Miller Park here and you would hear the clickety clack on your tires from all the crack cement and uh, it just always reminded me of uh, the train. Well, we're coming to the end of my first moto vlog. Uh, I hope you enjoyed Miller Park. If you've got any suggestions for how I do this or any content that you want me to cover, just let me know and uh, we'll be doing more of these in the future. Thanks for watching and don't forget, like and subscribe. Go Tigers!